Hello lads, we are looking back to another episode of the WWE for us to go to the problem. So, now it's night time today here. As you can see we are back in our new-ish city again. But uh, there's been a couple of new developments. So, um, I sort of did this all off camera because I, uh, I was waiting for that to build and I got bored. So. Oh, also... All, the, all this stuff is also pretty new, but I uh, sort of forgot to record that, all that as well. But I have no fear, we're going to be recording something today. But uh, anyway, so we have this like nice palace of culture and science here, very cool. And we've got a couple of hotels here, which uh, actually don't have any, don't really have any stuff in them just yet. We've also got, you know, our uh, whole food that we've here. Now, we've only got um, a couple of these running right now, just because of... Uh, even with all these farms, we are only barely able to keep these two food factories and this oil running. So it's, uh, it's a bit janky, to say the least. Now, well, I've also gone and expanded the farms out here just a bit and reclaim some land because uh, we, j we have to, otherwise we don't. We, can't, we just can't do this. But, uh, yeah, now. We are going to once again further expand our housing here because, of course, we don't, we still don't have enough room for housing, which is uh, saying some shit. Also, I sort of redesigned the roads here a bit. Uh, there, there used to be a couple of parking spaces here, but I think those for kindergarten to move parking spaces down here. And oh yeah, we also replaced a bunch of our uh, third intersections with roundabouts because roundabouts are cool, and I don't care what the fucking Americans think. Also, we have cars now, like a, a, a shit ton of cars, so roundabout good. Roundabout good. Anyway, we're going to be. Um, we've also introduced a bit of geothermal heating. None of this on, no, because, of course not. But yeah. We've got geothermal heating to mix with our uh, electrical heating. Because we are not producing enough electrical heat to run this place so. and that uh, well that 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 is this is after i've uh, significantly expanded the electrical import lines here look at this how many lines is this like um there, there are like five different 18 megawatt hour power lines just coming in from nuco nuke town over there so a nice spot center here but uh, yeah, this this is not enough, and we're going to have to figure out how to expand this even more. Yeah, it's, it's gonna be fun. Yeah, there, there's this like, nice uh, uh, one-way gas station. So go in here, and you curve in, and you just merge back into the loop. I'm quite proud of that, but uh, it it is sort of in the way of. Uh, you know, for development, so it's a bit of a shame. Let's got some nice TV stations and stuff here. We've uh, begun broadcasting propaganda, which has got our uh, what I want to call the communism simping stat up to 70%. Whoa! But uh, anyway, so why do we need more housing? Well, we need more housing to, so we can produce more chemicals. And we need more housing because. I plan on this being our production hub for all vehicle types, not just cars. Not just aluminum. But also trains. Well, maybe not trains. Uh, we all, well, we do have a train network here, but it's, uh, it's a train network we've been paying money for. We don't have a train construction office. And I, don't, I, don't, I can't really ex see uh, the trains expanding to any other island. I guess they could theoretically make it here. But there's nothing that says they can't. But like, look at this. Is this look like an island with enough space for trains? No, and that's we've sort of developed it that way. And uh, yeah, can't trip more trains in here unless I uh, reclaim a bunch of land here, which I can't really do because there's a bunch of oil derricks in the way. So basically, this 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 chunk here is the only place I can search for a train. 
we were originally going to build a dry dock here, but uh, that's been moved over here. But, like, imagine if we were replaced this bus station with the train station. Where the hell would the tracks go exactly? So, uh, no trains for this island. This island is going to keep its trains, however. Um, I'm I'm considering linking this whole chain of islands up with with trains, and maybe we're reclaiming a bunch of this land here. Because uh, we need a lot more land for farming. Now, um, the farm. Well, I found. Oh, there's this like, lovely mod in here. So remind me to use this thing for any uh, future. Like um, any future farm expansions. Because these are cool. These are like nice uh, farms. Sort of look more in line with the style we're going for here. This this is nice, but. The other stuff still. But anyway, remove them. Yeah, so we've got these mods for uh, vertical farms, which are massive, but and they consume chemicals and produce crops, and they produce huge amounts of them. But they also take lots of workers. Now, uh, we're not going to build these anytime soon because uh. Well, for one, they're, they're sort of expensive, just a bit expensive, but uh, mostly it's, it it just doesn't really match with the fact that it's currently not even 1980. So, we are going to build those probably in the future at some point, but uh, we're going to put a damper on that for now. Now, instead, what you're going to do, probably, is... We might want to just reclaim a bunch of land on this island and convert it into more farms. Now, how are we going to do this? Well, this is going to be a, mostly just going to be an autonomous island. There will be no housing no workers. It's just going to be farms and lots of farms. Like, um, alternatively, we could build a bridge over this strait here. Yeah, I think that I think that might be what we're going to do actually. But uh, anyway. So that's what we're going to be doing today. So, I'll, I'll, oh, oh, yeah. oh, that's that's what I'll be doing today. Um, for today's uh, video, we'll probably just uh, zone some more housing first. So let's get to it. So, first step over. Okay. As I was saying, first step of a new housing development is to just uh, zone the gravel. Gravel squares. So like this is going to give us a rough idea of how we want to shape this place. Not a full idea because uh, of course we can't get a full idea. But uh, some idea. So, uh, this is basically all the land we have available, unless we want to expand over here, but I'm saving this section for industry. Now, how do we want to do this? You know, the town center here, it's uh, pretty effective. And I'm gonna want to attempt to replicate this. Sort of. So, <laughs> under this new plan, this place is probably going to be roughly the center of town. And now, of course, that means buses are going to eat a lot of people here, which isn't especially efficient. So I'm considering this section just be um, for that. And we're going to have another section, which is going to be serviced by a mix of uh, private cars, bus, and maybe even rail. It is uh, not inconceivable that we could have to connect this our rail network here up to some passenger trains. Well, so this is going to be very work intensive, and to get people here, bus is going to be not the most effective method available. Yes. But we're going to have to provision for it. So, uh, first thing first. 
let's get to level this place and uh, reclaim some land. So there is a significant part of this run just because of how moist all our building space is. It's going to be reclaiming lots of land to build on. Let's move it up this so, yeah, and you just want to sort of repeat this process until you get something that is big enough to build on and looks decent. Yeah, I said this is okay. The, the grass is going to grow back and it should be fine then. Okay, so what are we doing now? Why? Uh, look, you see this road here. Basically, we want to extend it. Uh, we can't really extend it right now because of our uh, house. Straight. Okay. So, uh, this section here is not really going to be built to handle sort of in the uh, in let's say infrastructure requirements. So, uh, I can't really afford. But I can't move, so I can't shut this road down just yet. What I'm going to do instead is I'm going to just um, step down the road roughly around the same course. Now we'll just back in a bit. So uh, it's a bit fiddly. What now? Yeah, no near snap, please. Uh, let's see. Is this good? Yeah, it's about as good as I'll ever get it, so. So we're gonna set down our pair of roads here. And I'm gonna realize I did not expand the land enough for this. To do this. And we might also uh, get some embankments in here. We have a nice little embankment more. It's gonna be Pretty cool, pretty cool. Yeah. Okay, so let's it's, it's a bit fiddly. But uh, yeah, this this decently smooth. So we're gonna of course want a nice big roundabout here. Okay, so the goal here is to su sort of supersede this road for the most part. So, now the thing is, I want to look two roundabouts that sort of feed into each other. Or do I want this road to sort of just run off? I think uh, two roundabouts is going to be the uh, more sustainable option here. So that's what I'm going to do. Now, uh, generally, I don't think most uh, cities are designed with double roundabouts. But, uh, you know what, uh, it's what we're going to have to do here, because I am bad, yes. I was not expecting we'd need more housing after this development, which basically doubled the population of this city. Doubled and a bit more actually, because of these smaller houses. But uh, you know what, guess what, we do need more housing, so... So we're just going to go with the uh, standard roundabout set up here. What is annoying? Please tell me this is round. Um, no, no, it isn't. Fuck. Um, the rest back here. Um, how do I want to do this? For fuck's sake, how, how do curves work in this game? Damn it. Give me some fucking curves. Ah. 
Yeah, this is a bit rat this is a bit small, so Oh so now so this works. Wow. Wow. Okay, so this would be great, but um, you know what? Fuck it. If this is what if this is what the game wants, if this is how the game wants to work, I'm gonna just, just I'm gonna fucking do this. To sort of figure out the right distance. Hey man, if if the game is going to give me a nice, easy way, to make big perfect circle. I am going to fucking take it. He wants to give me a nice easy circle. I am going to take it. Now we could probably build a bunch of stuff in here. Probably be a nice place for this clock tower, but you know this clock tower needs to be visited because it's also it also acts as a tourist attraction. So point. Now what you can do then is. Uh, now this gas station though is uh, not used nearly often enough. There really that is going to be an issue. I know it's sort of this. It sort of uh, get, gets rid of the point of the entire outer roundabout circle thing. But uh, you know what? Fuck it. Yeah, yeah, fuck it. Who cares, right? This is going to work and it's going to be fine. Okay, so you guys do this. Get your asses to work. You guys, you don't want to. We only have helicopter offices on this island, which is, makes a bit annoying. We need to pay for a bunch of stuff, but uh, it it's better. I find it to be a better option. Yet, oh god, what the hell is going on? With you? Oh, I guess I guess just helicopter things there. Just helicopter things. Oh god, it's getting dark. Fuck. Um. Okay, okay, okay. So uh, let's uh, go along this this road. Going to be sort of like a baseline for everything. Oh, what the hell is this game? Oh, gosh darn it, game! Why are you like this? Okay, is this lined up? Okay, this is lined up. No, it is not. Fuck. Uh oh. Uh, straight. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And you know what? You get a roundabout. You get a roundabout. Everybody gets roundabout. Roundabouts work. They fucking work. And we're gonna have a bunch of fucking traffic on you. So I'm gonna go with you as a fucking roundabout. No, you are not changing my mind. We are using roundabouts. What the fuck are you? Bruh. 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 Man. Man, I hate when they do that. Okay. This is gonna be a small. It's not perfect. But you know what? Fuck you. I'm not gonna put. I'm not gonna make this fucking perfect. No, fuck you. I'm gonna make this a fucking roundabout. It's gonna, it's gonna be round. That, that's sort of the point. 
not gonna be a fucking perfect roundabout. Because then that's too much effort for me. I'm, I'm a lazy fuck, okay? But uh, yeah, we're gonna do this. It's gonna work. It's gonna be fine. And we're going to have the uh, grand construction officers do all of this. Uh, and it's gonna start raining. Okay, I thought it was going to be dark. It's raining instead. Which, you know, isn't much better, but, uh, but I guess it's okay. Anyway, uh, right, so because we did this, we're going to have the first zero. Some nice new ground. Uh, the game seems to hate doing this. It lags the, it lags the bejesus out of itself every time you try to zone in a nice big square. So that's a bit annoying, but uh, you, you can work with it. I'm gonna want to make this uh, nice and round. I may or may not know what you're thinking. No, we're not doing that. Stop now, fun. But yeah, this this how it's gonna work. We got the swarm helicopters flying back and forth, aren't they cute? Anyway, so we need residential. This place is gonna be residential. So how are we gonna set this up? Dude, how are you gonna set this up? So, um. Residential. Res residential. There. There you go. Congratulations, though. You learned to be. Isn't it amazing? Okay, and we're just going to get a bunch more of these with nice homes. Going to recess a bit. Bit too much there. Spacing on this one is going to be slightly different. Always. Yes, you can totally tell the difference. Here we go. Um, I mean. Probably wouldn't hurt. But, uh, no, we don't have any trolley bus in the structure here. That's a bit much. That, that trolley bus is a repug thing. I am not the pug. Probably bus is our very tough thing to do. I, 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 we are not going to be using trolley buses here. Um, it may be for the next. I may do it in the next run because uh, I made a nice idea for a nice run idea for the pub. Of this. I made a nice run idea for the pub and. Um, well, he's not really been playing this game much at all. I'm annoyed about, sort of. I'm sort of annoyed about, but uh... Yeah, he's not been playing much of this game. Which uh, means I'll probably, I might I'll probably just end up stealing the idea. Because uh, fucking damn it, Pug, if you're not gonna play the game, I'm gonna fucking play it for you. Okay, so the spacing isn't quite perfect, but uh, we can shove five more long houses in here, and we're gonna be able to stick some road, some of the kindergartens and stuff in here. 
so uh, in the garden. In the garden, there you go. So yeah, there's a massive kindergarten demand when you have population centers this large. So you sort of end up having to zone entire areas to just fill them with kindergartens. The, the flow is interesting, I'll, I'll, I'll say that. But uh, yeah, there's going to be an entire sort of lane here that's just kidding on this. But uh, of course, we also need schools, so a couple of school we need this. Oh, no. So, um, because of how this works, yeah. You're not letting people move in. No, no, no. We're not letting people move in here. Nobody is going to be moving in here, you know. Absolutely nobody is moving in here. Good. But, uh, yeah. So, uh, because of how uh, helicopter construction works, we sort of need to zone these. And, you know, we have to wait for these ones to build before we build anything here. Or they just won't build because of uh, restrictions, I guess. And by that I mean the helicopters just can't land anywhere. Which makes it a bit annoying. It is what it is. Okay, so, but we've still got a bit of zip room here, so we're gonna zone, zone this for construction as well. And these nice gravel squares not only make the city look pretty nice, but uh, they, they're also handy dudes for marking out how big you want the city to be. Just to fuck them up, like anything else. I'm just like everything else in this game, including all my cities. Yes, I am not afraid to admit that all my cities are all up with perfect designs. See me. So, we sort of need to just clean this, like, angle up. Diversion aside, so this is going to be it. Okay, so how do we want to do this? Well, we need shops. We need lots of shops. We have nice, a nice little universal complex here, and this is nowhere near full. So we're just going to repurpose this, and we're just going to end up, probably end up dropping a bunch of students off here. But there would you ask? Um, this is a single lane road. And it is. But, uh, there isn't a massive amount of traffic going through here. There is some, of course, but because there's uh, no parking lot set on this, it's uh, mostly. There is no turn there, pretty much, which makes it okay on the grand scale of things. It's not ideal, but it should be able to handle a bit more bus traffic. Especially since this is a pass through bus station with minimal appearance. But, uh. No. It's dark again. It's dark again, which is always fun. But, uh, yeah. 
they want a central rail station doing uh, let's see station for the four or uh, we could bring for a Voskal or a Vok Voksa or a Is um two and well we can get this central railway station even two thousand fifteen hundred uh three thousand uh, uh the Barcader River Station Riga River Station uh we started just going over the uh available lines. Uh, this, is also, this, is this is also 1500. Uh, how many buses do we have? We have three buses. And uh, this one works the coolest. Fortunately, we should uh, only uh, two pass through the rail line. I mean, it could work. It could work. Let's pause the game and think about it. Oh, yeah. We have this one, which uh, looks good. But this one, which also looks good. Wait, hold on. Oh, oh, it's literally this building with a train. No, uh, that looks weird. Really uh, we have this one, which is a. You know. I mean, it looks okay, but at the same time, it's also one of those brick. It's a brick building. So, I think that, um, looks long. Is there any difference? Oh, it just changes, uh, how fucking massive this train is. Oh, okay, oh. Medium. Oh yeah, medium, medium is nice. Medium is, uh, just about the size we want here. Yeah, so we swap this down here, it's gonna look nice. Yeah, okay, you know, yeah, let's put it here. Uh, you should still be able to walk through, right? Um, let me uh, just get up the measure. Oh, what? Before I use this thing again? Oh, oh, oh. Okay, so this is not. Um, okay, so this isn't ideal. So this is uh, 400 meters, which they can't walk. So unfortunately, while this does look nice, we might not be able to. Um, let's just use you as an example. How far can you walk? Uh, you can walk all the way to uh, 382 meters. You? How far can you walk? You you can get 400 meters, but this is slightly above 400 meters, I think. So, uh, yeah, well, well, welcome to Workers and Resources City Design, where you sort of have to figure out this stuff. Okay, so I think I can make this look okay. If I, uh, stick you here. You, you line up these two. But uh, yeah, if I stick you here, uh, put it a couple more houses. No, 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 no. Uh, yes, Is there a pub in here? No, I don't think. 
But you know what there could be? There could be a puppy. Okay, um, yeah, pretty cool. Not ideal, but it will work. Okay, the building is not power supply and this is not, but that's fine. But uh, yeah, we've got a nice pub here. And so, um, You can have one of these. This, uh, sim. I think that's how it's pronounced. Yeah, then we can slap it down here. And at the corner of this place was that neighborhood. We could have a universal map. We could have a Stalinka shop. Or, uh, we could have a gastronome. It's uh, yeah, I think we're gonna, I think we're gonna get you here. It's just the um, better option. No, we're not gonna connect you off road, and road just yet. But we're gonna weigh, weigh your stuff. So, um, storage. A nice warehouse for the end of the two. You should be good here. So we don't want the break connectivity in this road because uh, that was sort of a screw up the construction. But what we can do is we can lay off the road separately here. For uh, future. We can just uh, stretch on this entire place. Why not, right? Yeah. So yeah, you know, this place is gonna get constructed eventually. But uh, no, we're not done yet. We need some residential in here. I don't want to do I don't want to do this. Uh, the Lismos 2A. It's a nice one for uh, corners. Looks decent. And has small enough footprint you can sort of lay up in the internal parts of this, which is ideal. Because, uh, yeah, so, uh, look, there's these ones, which are really larger, but because of how the game works, you can't put stuff inside the, uh, corridor. And, uh, yeah, so, some buildings, this all this by having this, uh, so there can be, uh, no collision, but, uh, this doesn't have that, so, yeah, so this is not good. But, uh, yeah, that's uh, sort of now. I'll be at a house squad in the room. Uh, yeah, we can have one of these here. And has a blue road, so we can pass a road through this. Uh, maybe have a bunch of parking in here, I don't know, we'll see. Oh, 
pull up and uh, get the modern mid sized towns to lift up. These are always nice to have. Okay, a bit of an alley here. No, yeah, that's right. So we want to, uh, in that case, we want to carry this road on this way. And then we're at the road here. Yeah, as you can see, this is how city plan goes. And uh, more residential. Wait, I see. Please don't. Oh, oh, no, no, please. no. You're not gonna allow citizens to move into this building. We are not letting people move in here. This place is not ready for moving. Please don't. Um, so, here. Yeah, that's not so we'll, we'll have this one look out to sea. Give them a nice sea view. I think, I think I'll have this one on the intersection here. Like this, because uh, we can save this for schools and stuff. Our house or people's house. So, um, 94, 4. You, you take up just a bit more space, don't you? Your, your house more. But, um, you also don't look quite Well, how do you? I'm not really sure. And their house too? Oh, yeah. Ah, ah. It's gonna be good. So, uh, let's get another one of those. Can we uh, get a big alley? Yes, we can. But... So, again, we're gonna leave a bit of space in here for the alley. Don't you know, we want a big alley. Okay, let's go ahead. What are our options for elves? GMBL. Uh, it's it easy for them, but uh, it does take a lot of space. We just have that. We have a shorter version. The link got underscored out. Uh, yeah, but you're tiny. Um. It's not gonna be the most space. But, uh, uh, yeah, you know what, I'll go for it. If you do house it, you'll find what you can do. Okay, we have a bunch of great parts for alleys. So we did want lots of possible alleys. What's the difference between small and medium? Uh, double medium, double size, and we'll just fill it. We'll have a couple of these down here. French. We, again, we're gonna we're gonna do one of these up here. So I'm trying. Not to. Oh shit! This this one isn't um, open for uh, movement. Oops. Must have forgot to check that. Oh yeah, this. 
Apparently the rich guy is giving you a deal. Cool. Sure. But, uh, yeah. Remember to turn off the land movements. Because uh, we don't want people moving in here before this place is completed. That would be a shit show of uh, massive proportions. So this is gonna, mostly going to be uh, serviced by a train station. But I do want buses to be able to get in here. So, um... I don't want to handle buses then. Yes, not that not, not actually, uh, no, no, you do have a, a bunch of slots here, so I can post I can probably but you double you as a bus stop as well. And that's okay. That'll, that'll that'll handle that. So uh, just keep going presidential bus. So we'll need a secret police here. Since our our main one here is, is a bit far away. Could get it to work, but um, I better just have it work. We'll see the police. Uh, let's, uh, let's have it be sort of in the distance over here. Hospital. Okay, so we do have a central hospital here. Sure. It's it's a bit occupied. So we're gonna need another one. So you know, I'll, I think we'll get the hosp I'll get it another hospital mode. There's like a nice one that I've been eyeing up for a while. And it could fit our. Uh, Like, this is a new development, and we are displaced by nice 50 snap houses. There, I do have like a nice 80 snap house mod that I've been eyeing up for a while, and I don't think it would look too bad with you know? So I guess I'll go back. Uh, in the always, always went for shit that I can do. Oh, let's see, let's see. Uh, A24. Yeah, sure, we might, we might as well have to face the roads like that. Well, might as well, right? But, uh, it's not done yet. So. We need a pub, um... How many people can you service? Uh, service 200. 200 is perfectly fine amount. We built this place and uh, it, it's a multiple pump 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 it uh, makes the uh, feel much way better investment. So this is going to be our kindergarten square mix. So we're going to have an alley coming down here. So that's a good path. So, uh... Playground is fine. Here we can uh, shove a couple of playgrounds in here that should, uh... 
finish this area off. That's basically. You can't have a town with other ones, can't you? There is no such thing as a town without, without the wind extension. A town without the wind extension is uh, Well, it's like a town without the wind statue. It's, 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 uh, it's a town without a wind statue is so unimaginable that you can't even imagine something like that. Yeah, that, that, that's right. That, that is uh, how unimaginable a town of the world is actually. So. Anyway. Fuck. Are you kidding me? You can't, you can't do it, boys. Uh, there was no, uh, no clip with. Uh, 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 my old speakers are no clip with that. It's, uh, man. Dumb back. Oh, he does. We need some like nice uh, no clip decoration to get shove in here so I don't feel like I've wasted a bunch of my space. Bridge? Yeah. No, we don't need a bridge anymore. Embankment? Fountain? Oh, yeah, the fuck. Yeah, um, I guess the fountain could work, but like, it's a bit too big. Yeah, yeah, okay, I guess we'll, I guess we'll just have to get four small fountains in there. I'm a bit small feet, we can't see anything better. Actually, uh, yeah, good deal. Um, is it under retraction? So we can stick a pool in here. Yeah, that, 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 that'll be great. Every town must have. Oh yeah, you're, you're already going flat out, so... We're gonna need a third heating plant, definitely. Very good to Or, um... You know, I've been trying to limit pollution here. But, um... I think it wouldn't be, um... It would be uh, unexpected if we uh, showed a nuclear heating plant out here on the outskirts of town. Trying to get like a nicely curved road, but yeah, it's that's not working out.
down a nice nuclear thing. on the outskirts of town so we're going to lose a bit of heat in the broadcasting but it means the uh, pollution will spread into the actual town itself which is uh, at least for this place more of a priority A bit of an angle, but uh, I don't think it's going to be enough to be on the score. Should be just a bit janky. Fit in this, which is always nice. And we'll of course be uh, going this way. Later, uh, we can't connect now. Yeah. Oh dear, uh, does this thing pollute? Does this thing make pollute? Um, it does 3.6 tons a year. Okay. That's, uh, that's not optimal. But I look at this thing, 12.6 tons a year. You make. How the fuck does an oil heating plant? But, uh, here in the green, and, uh, you know, if you have any problems, you'll go right next to the hospital. 56% health, uh, well, um, what's up with the health? Uh, is it, is it, could it possibly be because you live right next to the heating plant? Maybe, but you're in the green. Nope. You, you know, you know, it'll make it feel better. Three. Nice, woody, woody. And you know what makes you feel even better than trees? That's right, a Lenin statue. Lenin statues. All problems. Anyway, not that that's done with. Got this done. Bro. How long have we been recording for? It? In a, an hour. Well, um, in that case, I don't. We're going to be deferring the. Development of farming infrastructure for the next episode, and I'm just gonna end this episode off by getting the great infrastructure ready. Yeah, yeah this, this is going to be our first train. Our first train operated residential. Area. And yeah, that's exactly what it sounds like. It's gonna be very great, boys. Great. Trains are cool, right? I think I think we might have just logged this entire area. Uh, quick, we'll activate three, three forest, three forest, three, three. No, okay, let me plant, we next time planted some trees in the roundabout. We don't want trees in the roundabout. Uh, 
No trees in the roundabout, please. Ladies and gentlemen, please get your trees out the roundabout. Thank you. Okay. So, um, where do we want to split this train? I think we'll have to run a bridge over this road. Yeah, this is a multi multi-facet issue here. We need a train platform here. Um yeah it's it's only gonna be an offloading point, so we don't need any capacity. We we only need one group here though, I think. Yes, it's um I'll be damned then. Not with me before I go. <laughs> but uh, with this, this uh, infrastructure here just won't support it. We don't have a major modification, so I don't think we will. I'll be. I'll probably end up trying it very horribly. So, make of that one through. Steel deck trust bridge. What do you look like? Oh, yeah, you look great. You look great. You're gonna be great for this. You are doing. You are going to go great. As long as we can. Uh, as long as we can. Uh, I do a bridge. Fuck you, me. Bitch. Bitch. Build the fucking bridge, folks. Bitch. Yep. Yeah. Bitch. Oh, oh, oh. Real, real? What the fuck am I paying you parallel? Oh, we don't want this to wind either too much. God, it's a bit near. But uh, I'll accept that. We don't want any here. Yeah, there's only gonna be a single, single trap. So at least, at least with this part. Uh, no, you can't pick those. I guess I'll have to do this now. Oh, this would be hella inefficient build, but uh, you know, we're paying for this anyway, so. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna fucking shake around two fucking round mounts. It's just the that right there. So I have to take the inside line. Um, let's see, three for two thousand. Yeah, that's fine.
Okay, we can just. Yeah, I guess we just gonna make this boss. This whole stretch is gonna be a one way. So yeah. So you know what the fuck are you waiting for? You just need work. You just need work. I guess we'll just get this alley down. Um, annoyingly, it's, it's very difficult to see alleys. So, uh, let's partially complete this alley so uh, you can get workers. Yeah, there we go. This, there should be a horde of workers coming in here now. And this is the other one. And you're up Great. So uh, we're just gonna wait for all this stuff to get done. And uh, I'll cut this episode here because we're at the hour now. So, cheerio, see you next episode. We're gonna be um, doing farm shit.